everyone, and welcome back to Bite Size Tech Facts. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of brain computer interfaces, or BCIs for short. Buckle up, because this technology is about to blow your mind. So, what exactly is a BCI? Imagine a direct line between your brain and a computer. BCIs use sensors to pick up on electrical signals generated by your brain activity. These signals are then translated by a computer program, allowing you to control external devices with just your thoughts. There are two main types of BCIs, non-invasive and invasive. Non-invasive BCIs, like headsets, use electrodes placed on your scalp to detect brain waves. Invasive BCIs involve implanting electrodes directly into the brain, offering a more precise signal but requiring surgery. All right, all right, enough with the science talk. Let's get to the cool stuff. What can BCIs actually do? The possibilities are mind-boggling. Imagine paralyzed individuals regaining mobility by controlling robotic limbs with their thoughts. Dive into VR worlds with unparalleled immersion, using your thoughts to navigate and interact. Forget controllers. Dominate the competition by controlling your in-game actions directly with your mind. AR experiences could become even more interactive, allowing you to manipulate virtual objects with your thoughts. BCIs could offer new ways for people with communication disabilities to express themselves or even help with rehabilitation after brain injuries. The future of BCIs. BCIs are still in their early stages, but the potential is truly limitless. In the future, BCIs could be used for enhanced learning and brain-computer merging. With all this amazing potential comes a responsibility to consider the ethical implications. Privacy concerns, potential misuse, and the digital divide are all important issues to address as BCI technology advances. Brain-computer interfaces are opening a new chapter in human technology interaction. The future is full of mind-blowing possibilities. What are your thoughts on BCIs? Would you ever try one? Let us know in the comments below.